One of the stars of the first two Hellboy films, Jeffrey Tambor, was recently on The Colbert Report and said the following, There is actually talk of a Hellboy 3, but they better hurry or I'm going to be in a walker. Great. In light of Tambor's comments, do you buy or sell that we'll get to see a Hellboy 3? Oh, God, I want to buy it so bad, but we've been w we've been waiting for this forever yeah. already. Yeah. And Ron Perlman has said the same thing, that, like, he can't be Hellboy much longer. Yeah. The only person that's still, like, able to do it, I think, is probably Doug Jones. Yeah. yeah. Like, is he do anything. Right? Because he's not of this <laughs> earth. <laughs> and, oh, God, I want to buy it so bad, and I just, I don't, I've given up yeah. hope. Yeah, I, I gotta sell it. I mean, mm -hmm. Del Toro himself said it perfectly when he said, look, if I'm gonna do Hellboy 3, it's gonna be a $200 million movie yeah. Yeah. because of what I wanna do with it. And th there's just no studio. When you look at the box office results of Hellboy and Hellboy 2, yeah. and I like both those movies yeah. very much, I, especially the first one, for me, I just it's got a very special place in my heart. But nobody's gonna give Del Toro $200 million to mm -hmm. do Hellboy 3 when it can't possibly make it back. So I, I don't know when Jeffrey's talking about these conversations happen, because there have been conversations. I just don't think they happen you know, on Tuesday. Yeah. So huh. I, 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 I want to say bye. I'm with you completely, but I gotta sell it, Christian. I'm selling it big time. Uh, I love I, both of them. I actually like two, almost a little mm -hmm. more than one. I, lo I, I love the first two, but for everything you just said, it, it, from what I heard, Estelle Tor said it wasn't gonna happen. I remember yeah. back in the day, too. So it's just if he's saying, if they bring in somebody else to do it, I don't want to see a third one. So no, no. It, it's yeah. Del Toro's yeah. project, so you have to do it with him. And I maybe Tambor was just kind of saying it, kind of goofing around, but it's it's not going to happen. Mary? Yeah, I sell it for all the reasons that have been mentioned. Also, um, you know, maybe the only way this could ever really happen is if for some strange reason somebody sees how well Pacific Rim 2 does and the big mm. budget that they're giving right. him and says, oh, well, maybe, but I still don't, I still don't see how this is happening. And conversations, like you said, our conversations. It's not like people are busting out deal memos and starting to sign on well, the dotted line. You have to do the math. Pacific yeah. Rim 2 isn't going to come out for another couple few more right. years. Yeah. And then right. you've got another long while before help. And then and he's, he's going to want to move no. on, though, yeah, too, doing from doing stuff. Things, yeah, I mean, right? but, but even he produces a lot of stuff. But, it, you know, if he's doing Pacific Rim 2 yeah. and then he does Hellboy 3, it's like Del Toro is the type of guy you want to see him do more than just the same types of movies. Let's yeah. see something new. Like he wants to do a lot I, of stuff. Yeah, I want another. I want another movie like Pan's Labyrinth. I yes, like any day of the week and twice on Sundays. But also, we'll let's not forget too. A lot of the comparisons to Pacific Rim. Pacific Rim made a lot more money right. than right. Hellboy or Hellboy Two did. Totally. So it's a little bit of a different yeah. story. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news as as well as our daily AMC movie talk show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.